Hey guys, it's Emily. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a what I eat in a day while on my elimination diet. So I recently got tested for food sensitivities through Everywell and I am doing an elimination diet for four weeks, cutting out all the foods that I was reactive to. And um, then after the four weeks, I'm gonna slowly introduce them to see which ones are causing issues and which ones are not. But I'm just gonna list to you all of the food sensitivities from lowest to highest reactivity. There's a decent amount of them, but I'm just gonna run through them. From lowest to highest, Oregano, egg yolk, bran, tuna, rye, black tea, mozzarella cheese, chicken, garlic, gluten, wheat, egg white, yogurt, and cow's milk are cow's milk are all of the um, foods that I am reactive to. So yeah, those are the ones that I will not be eating for another three weeks because I've been doing this for one week so far. Let's just get into what I eat in a day. Okay, excuse that I look like actual poop right now, but um, I just woke up not that long ago. It's about 7.45 right now and I'm going to make myself some breakfast. I'm usually extremely hungry right when I wake up, so... I'm gonna show you guys what I'm gonna make for breakfast. Okay, this was my first time ever making these pancakes, but I just used a gluten-free pancake mix by Bisquick, and I found some instructions online that just replaced the egg with baking powder, and then instead of using milk, they used a non-dairy milk, so I used almond milk, and it also called for some water, which the original recipe does not. finish these pancakes. They're the same color as my bananas. Something's not right with that. <laughs> I don't know. They're really sticky. Really? Yeah. <laughs> like it's hard to like chew it. I don't know. Do they taste like a pancake? Not really. I mean they're close to it I guess. Might be the closest thing I'd get to a pancake. It looks like a biscuit, kind of. I think it tastes like a biscuit more than anything. Mm. No, I don't know, it's not bad. It looks good. Mm. I like it. Mm. Really? Yeah. It should taste really good. You can eat the whole piece? No, thanks. Are you sure you like yes. it then? Yeah. I'm sure I like it, but yeah, I need to try it if you want. Well, I'm actually really, really full from that breakfast, which is weird because my breakfast never fills me up. I'm usually still starving, and I didn't even eat the other half of my banana, so I'm gonna put it in a bag and save it for when I get hungry. But yeah, that's what I had for breakfast, so... Peace out. I almost forgot that I was filming this video, but I'm working on editing the video that I filmed yesterday. I am eating the leftover other half of the banana from my pancakes this morning as a snack and it's a, almost 11 30 right now so i'm probably gonna make lunch soon but for now i'm just gonna have this as a snack okay so it's about 12 54 right now and it's storming outside so i'm sorry if you hear that and our lights like just flickered because the power is probably gonna go out but i'm about to make some lunch Okay, so for lunch, I am just having some celery that I cut up and also I'm having a kiwi and some leftover turkey that we had in the fridge and some mixed nuts. And yes, I know that both of my brothers decided they needed to be in this video. I'm 
I'm about to leave for my dentist appointment. I have to get some fillings done, and um, I'm not really sure when the next time I'll be able to eat will be just because they're like numbing my mouth or whatever and it might be sore but I'm packed some gluten-free uh, blueberry checks cereal that I'm gonna eat on my way there and yeah so I'm just gonna eat this for a snack and I'll see you guys at dinner time for dinner, I had two pieces of leftover turkey bacon and then I made these chickpea rotini noodles that were actually really good. And I know this seems like an odd combination, but when you are eating on a food sensitivity diet like this, it is really hard to find food. So for dessert, I'm just gonna be eating this smoothie bowl or like nice cream or whatever you wanna call it that I made. Yesterday I ate the other half last night and I'm gonna eat it now I'll probably eat it all maybe not I'm not sure these are filling sometimes but yep that's what I'm gonna eat that is everything for my what I eat in a day and I hope you guys enjoyed if you did then go ahead and subscribe to my channel and if you like this video then give it a like and comment down below any other ideas you have for other videos for me to do and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys!